एवरी वन वेलकम बैक वंस अगेन टू माई ऑफिशियल यूट्यूब चैनल इंग्लिश बाय प्रीति भारद्वाज इन दिस वीडियो वी विल कवर सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ चैप्टर नंबर सेवन ग्लिम्सिस ऑफ इंडिया दिस पार्ट इज टाइटल्ड एज कुर्ग एंड इज रिटन बाय लोकेश अब्रोल इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द टाइटल ऑफ दिस पार्ट द टाइटल इज कुर्ग विच इज द नेम ऑफ अ डिस्ट्रिक्ट विच इज लोकेटेड इन कर्नाटका In fact, it is the smallest district of Karnataka, and Kurg is also known as Kodagu as well. And the location of the Kurg has been told here that it is located midway between Mysore and Mangalore. And Kurg is famous for its eternal beauty, for the martial men, beautiful women, and wild creatures of this place. Okay, and uh, this is home to the evergreen rainforest, the spices and coffee plantations, and the visitors. Uh, the visitors visit this place mainly from September to March because during this uh, this time, because during these months, the weather is perfect, and the coffee plantation uh, here is in such huge number that we can even smell it in the air as well. Okay then further talking about the people of Kurg it is believed that they have this hereditary derivation they have this belonging from Greek or Arab now the story which goes with the uh, connection with the Greek land is that once Alexander's army was at that place was in the Kurg Kurg when they were moving along the southern coast of India okay and it became very difficult it became very impractical for them to return back so what they did was that uh, the army members of alexander's army they got married with the locals of kurg area okay and henceforth their culture got mixed up with the culture of kurgi people and uh, it is clearly visible from the uh, marriage ceremonies and from the religious ceremonies which are usually different from those of the hindu religion now further if we talk about the story which has a connection with the arab land it says that the people in arab they wear a certain type of dress which is known as kufia okay kufia k u w f i a and these people who live here in kurg who are also referred to as kodavus they also wear same sort of dress but that is known as kupia so there is some sort of similarity between kufia and kupia which which are worn by the arab people and kurgi people the similarity is that this dress is a long black coat with an embroidered belt on the waist okay so because of that similarity clarity in the attire in the uh, dressing style it is believed that these people of kurg land they have this hereditary derivation their descent their belonging to the arab land as well okay now further uh, the hospitality of these kurgi people have been talked about as in uh, they welcome all the guest all the uh, tourist all the visitors with a very big heart and with a very warm welcome then the kurgi regiment has been talked about kurgi regiment which is the most decorated regiment in indian army and the first chief of the indian army who was general kariappa was also from kurg okay he was a kurgi and even nowadays it is uh, it is this that the kodavus the people who are living there in kurg they are allowed they are permitted to carry firearms without any sort of license okay then further in the next paragraph the beauty of this land has been talked about the river kaveri has been talked then mahasir which is the largest which is the large fresh water fish that has been talked about then the bird king fisher is talked then the wildlife has been talked about okay and then it is said that uh, even the most laziest people even the laziest people when they arrive at this place this place kurg even they get very excited they also become very energetic after uh, getting to know after seeing through all the adventurous activities which are there in kurg area then further different adventurous activities of this area have been talked about like river rafting canoeing rappling rock climbing and mountain biking then walking trails all these are the adventurous activities adventurous sports of this area okay and then the birds and butterflies have been talked about then the scenic view of kurg has been talked about like the moment you will climb up the brahmagiri hills from there you can have the view of this beautiful land 
landscape in front of you and if you will walk across the rope bridge from there you can see the uh, nisarg dhamma nisarg dhamma is that place where the largest tibetan uh, uh, buddhist um, buddhist monastery is there which you can see uh, and uh, near the baila kupe baila kupe is the name of a place here where is the india's largest tibetan settlement is there where you can see many monks in uh, different robes of yellow and red color okay so this is the chapter uh, which is about the beauty of the land of kurg which is about the beauty of the people of kurg so that's all about this part i hope this video will help you in understanding it better for the next part stay tuned to the channel very soon i will upload that as well if you have liked the video hit the like button in the comment section down below let me know which topic you want me to cover next share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel thank you and have a nice day